Hi, this is Jennifer Minster for SavannahNow.com, and in this edition of Local Music Now, we're talking to Michelle Aspen. Well, Michelle, thank you very much for letting me come out and talk to you. I really appreciate it. Absolutely. Absolutely. Tell, tell us a little bit about when and why you started singing. Well, Jennifer, you're actually like sitting in my home. This is where I do the writing. This is where we we take ideas and from paper and we actually put them into, you know, things that people can hopefully appreciate and enjoy and use in their everyday life, you know. And um, I've been living in Nashville for the last two years and I moved home in October and just to, you know, spend more time with family. But since I've been here, I got home and then I signed a publishing deal. Uh, with a Nashville, you know, with a Nashville company a week after I was here. So, fortunately enough, I have Don Coyer, who has the studio here in Rinkin, and we work, we work hard, you know, uh, at least a few times a week when we get songs down and we, like I said, we make these ideas happen and then we send them off to Nashville. Oh, very cool. And where we're start, we are, right now we've got 16 songs on our catalog and we've only been working at this for about three weeks. Wow. And there's about 300 or so <laughs> songs that I've written. That's so amazing. we got some work to do, yeah. but it's, it's a lot of fun. your style would you say it's country your genre well I would say it was modern country okay. Okay. and some of the things I write also have a pop or an alternative edge yeah. uh, just depending on the song I, I'm very I don't have one specific genre that I try to stick to uh, yeah. because the way that I write I know everyone's different I learned that in Nashville the hard way because people would everybody has different methods yeah. you know I guess that's yeah. with anything but my method is usually uh, I just I start hearing I just start hearing a song and I have to distinguish whether or not it's already on the radio yeah. or whether it's in my head <laughs> on Michelle's personal radio and then I you know from there I'll just start writing yeah. and um, the words come really easily I, I never have to you know push for lyrics or anything and if I do then I put it up yeah. because I feel like that's not meant to be for that moment you know well, let's talk a little bit about your future where um, where do you hope to see your music career going? Well, one big thing I learned in Nashville, it was a rude awakening for me in the aspect of finances and usually you've got to have the finances there and in order to go anywhere, well, my writing ended up benefiting me beyond belief. I, I'm going to, well, I'm, with my publishing deal, I hope to write for other artists that don't write, you know, um, that are great, you know, uh, there's all sorts of people I could tell you where I would love to be, you know, to have songs on hold with them and as well as I would I would love to either sign an independent label or you know if, if I got a, a decent enough offer from a, one of the you know more the larger ones yeah. I would definitely take it yeah. and with that you know I, I just hope to be an artist I want to write songs for everyone else mm -hmm. and I, I do my mission is to just write a song for everyone that doesn't think there's that song out there you know what I mean very cool oh, yeah. 